Hong Kong University of Science and Technology student Frank Wang has always had an interest in helicopters. However, it was only after he entered university that he had a chance to study them more seriously. His hard work paid off in June this year when his high tech helicopter flew around Mount Everest and, in doing so, became the world's first unmanned flight around the world's highest mountain. While the helicopter may look similar to a remote controlled model helicopter, it is actually a highly sophisticated machine. It is equipped with GPS and can fly on a pre programmed path. When powered by an electric battery, the helicopter can travel a maximum distance of 50 kilometers at its top speed of 70 kilometers per hour. When propelled by diesel, its radius increases to over 200 kilometers. A camera attached to the helicopter allows users to capture photographs and videos during flight. Live images are then sent back to a handheld remote control unit. This functionality opens up a world of possibilities for the chopper. Wang, now a postgraduate student, has started a company in Shenzhen that hires out its fleet of 10 helicopters to everyone from real estate developers who want to video their newly completed projects to local authorities who want to track animal migration. The machine also came into use in May last year when the helicopter was deployed to Sichuan to help with rescue and relief work after the May 12th earthquake. It took hundreds of aerial photos of affected cities, towns and counties to help authorities in assessment of infrastructure damage. However, the flights in June around Mount Everest will not be the high point for this helicopter. Wang is currently working on improvements so it can realize his ultimate goal of landing on the 8,850 meter peak of Mount Everest, which he hopes to achieve in one year's time. For the South China Morning Post, this is Richard Pine.